Hello everyone, it's a Hubble Bubble here, and welcome back to another episode of Minecraft Better on Bedrock. So, I have done a lot off camera, not in the house, as you can tell. I mean, everything looks pretty much the same. Um, but, as you can tell, I do have my bow. Um, and I really want to do something with these netherite shovels because I finally worked on the nether, not nether, the, um zombie spawner and i made it to something else and i also found some stuff so we need to get some items before we do anything starting off with blaze rods we're going to need those oh we also had a um a bunch of maybe we did there we go a brewing stand then let's grab um Grab a waste stone. And then let's grab a bunch of wood. We're going to need a bunch of wood. Grab some more chest. I've already got a bed down there just in case. And then maybe some iron we'll take with us. How about some diamonds as well? Take 14 with us. And then, of course, we're going to need our emeralds. And then, any other potions we could take with us. These are just strength and healing potions, so nothing that we're going to really need. And then, let's grab all these netherite shovels. Let's take our obsidian pickaxe with us just in case. And we don't need our water buckets. Maybe we'll take a bucket with us just in case. And then, how about some books, of course. Take some of the books. We'll take the paper. Anything else that we could take? Ooh, soul speed. My question is, can we put soul speed on these boots? We cannot. That is the only thing bad about course and armor is you cannot enchant this armor. Probably because it's, it's OP and we don't need to. Um, but that does really suck about Corpse Knight armor is that you cannot enchant it. Do we have any Stardust? We do have Stardust. How do we make Stardust armor? It's been so long since I made some. Stardust, Stardust, Stardust. Stardust armor, where are you? Star. Oh, we need ingots. And now we're going to need netherite. I totally forgot that we're going to need the piercing embodiment, which we get from the nether, or from the end. We're going to need a lot of netherite, but in the end, hopefully we'll get a bunch of um, netherite as well. We've already got quite a bit. I mean, we can make these into ingots already. How many ingots can we make? Two? And we just need some more. Yeah, we've got six already, so that's pretty good. And we're going to need about like 36 ingots, so that's going to be around over a stack of netherite. Um, what else do I need for over there? Probably a backpack. Let's take two of them. Just because my inventory does get pretty full pretty quickly. And then, sorry it's taking so long. I just want to make sure that I've got everything that I need. Do I need anything else? I've got a waystone. I don't really need these quite yet. Ooh, you know what my other question is? I wonder if we could put this... Oh, you know what? I need a smithing table, and I don't have a smithing table right now. Because I was going to see if we can put armor trims on here, on our corsonite armor. But I don't think we can. At least we've got extra corsonite for when we make some more, um, if we make more armor. So, let's go ahead and put all this into our chest, or into our... Um, inventory 
Perfect. And then I'm also going to put this bow in here because we are going to try and OP our bow that we currently have got because let's just say she is not in the best of shape. What else are we going to need? Mainly just blaze rods. Glass. We're going to need glass for sure. Let's go ahead and put that in our backpack. Perfect. And anything from the nether that we should take with us? Anything at all? Oh, you know what? We're going to need mushrooms. Fermented spider eyes. We only have one spider eye. This is not good. I've got two zombie villagers that I've got to... breed and we also need more sugar cane alrighty so looks like I got a mission that I need to accomplish starting off with planting our sugar cane and possibly finding some more I'm going to actually put this over here since we've got a water source over here so hopefully this will go pretty quickly there we go Alrighty, I'll be right back. Oh my gosh, how is this the first time that I'm seeing this? Take a look at this. We've got one of those monster eggs. One of these bosses over here. I did not know that this was here. Otherwise, I would have fought this boss a, lo long, a long time ago. Well, I probably wouldn't have, but it's a thought that counts, right? Okay, so now we are looking for Spideruses. And I'm only seeing creepers and skeletons. That was a fail. Let's go ahead and take care of this skeletor. Any spiders? I thought I saw some spiders over here. Oh god. Oh, I hear one. Yay! We got a spider eye, so we're going to wait for it to be nighttime. We're going to take care of some spiders and hopefully get some more. It looks like there's some spiders up here. Let's take care of this bad boy. You know what I also should put on my sword is looting. Because I just have smite and unbreaking. Maybe I should put some looting on here. I do have a, a book at home that I could use. So why don't I do that quickly? Alrighty, so I went ahead and found our looting book in the chest. It's got protection three and then looting. It'd be sad to see the protection three go, but you know what? It's for the benefit of the doubt. It's already turning nighttime. And bam, got a looting sword. Let's see if there's any other enchants we could put on here. No, no. 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 Because you can't put some my and sharpness together. No. No. Sharpness. Oh, I wish I had sharpness. That would be a lot better than freaking smite. I'm not seeing any other ones. Protection. Ooh, that's pretty good. Loyalty, soul speed 2, projectile protection, sharpness, feather falling, impaling, protection. Nope, not seeing any other ones, but look, it is getting dark. So we're going to run over here and take care of some bad guys, some baddies. Alrighty, so I just returned from the nether and from the overworld. This is the haul that I've received. Um, I've got 15 spider eyes, 11 brown mushrooms, 15 red mushrooms, and 15 sugar cane. Oh, funny how it's all 15. That is very interesting. So, what we're going to do now is I'm going to show you the location of where our new entrance is for our spawner because I did a lot of work off camera, like I said, um, working on basically making it a infinite experience farm and then also making it um a place for 
something that's very a bit a very big surprise. I kind of spoiled it just a little bit earlier when I said that there are zombies over there, and you guys have probably already guessed what we are working on. But um, I'm going to save the um, final answer for when we get over there. So it's just right over this mountain, and you can tell that big old pillar over there is where our new entrance is and you'll see why it's our new entrance because I like I said I did a lot of work a lot a lot of work let's just jump over here and then we'll just go over to our new entrance that was our old entrance over there look how far away it is compared to this one but I made a straight down a straight entrance down here and take a look at this we've got our big room with our spawner in here tinted glass is not cheap to make let me just say without having a geode um, it was not cheap <laughs> it was really expensive but also take a look what else I've got we've got some zombie villagers over here so that is what we're going to be working on today you know what I forgot at the house Gold. Golden apples is what I forgot. <sighs> I'm going to run back to the house. We're finally back here. <laughs> We've got our 33 apples and our 59 gold blocks. We just also have some gold ingots that we've killed from that we've got from zombies. Um, but let's go ahead and get our backpack out with all of our that's the wrong backpack um, with all of our wood in it because we are going to make a wooden chest not a wooden chest we're going to make a crafting table with our wood so let's go ahead and make that and then let's go ahead and place this over here just since it's a little bare bones and then let's put our stuff in here so we have a clear and empty inventory gonna put our apples our gold our everything else right here put our logs in here and then also we are going to take everything else out of here put it into these chests so that way our backpacks do not have to be full Ooh, let's put our waystone down I totally forgot that I have my waystone let's place it where should we put it Maybe right here. We'll name this Zermby Spawn. Zermby Spawn. I like that. Zermby Spawn. Okay. Let's go ahead and make a. I forgot my obsidian, but guess what we've got? We've got this bad boy, so now we can run to the house real quick. Grab some obsidian because we are going to make another, um, what's it called? Uh, what is the name of the thingy that you, enchanting table. <laughs> We're going to make another enchanting table. We're also going to bring one of our anvils over so that way we have our... One of those lights changed and I don't like it. I don't like it. Let's grab our obsidian and then let's grab... We've got diamonds. We've got books. I think that's all we need. We've got wood. Um, I think that's all we need besides an anvil. We'll take this one with us. And then let's head back. Alrighty, so I've got a lot set up. I've got our enchanting table, our anvil. I've already got some of our stuff that we're going to need. Let's go ahead and make this all into sugar. Make some f fermented spider eyes. And then let's fill up these glass bottles that I received. And then let's go ahead and place these bad boys into here. Let's grab our blaze rods and make blaze powder. And then we'll go ahead and place this bad boy in here. And then I think all we have to do is put a fermented spider eye in here and it should make a weakness potion. 
but let's go ahead and put everything back into here. So that we have it all. Put our glass in here. Should be almost done here in a few seconds. Yes, make a weakness potion and then we add gunpowder to it. Slowly but surely. And now we've got weakness potions. So now what we'll do is we will grab some gold and some apples. And then we will go ahead and make three golden apples. And then we'll break this wall. Throw this potion down. And give the apples to them. And then we'll just watch and see what happens. Alrighty, so I've been down here for like an hour trying to roll a mending trade. And guess what I finally got? Not for a great price, but you know what? It is what it is. Mending for seven emeralds. That, that's pretty crazy. That is insane. But it originally was 32 emeralds. And then what we're going to do is we're going to have this guy. I haven't traded with him yet. We're going to have this guy become a, um, a cleric. So that way I can trade all this rotten flesh that I'm getting. Because take a look down here of how much rotten flesh I'm getting. Just look at that. That's, that's bizarre. And that's just rotten flesh that I'm getting. Not to mention all of these um, potions of strength that I've gotten. All of these. <laughs> um... But yeah, that's what we're going to do. I just have these two mending books for right now. What we're going to do is I'm going to... There is a way to make a net. Where's my crafting table? Net. Another cake, another lamp. Cage, maybe? Glowstone in a cage. That's pretty cool. Let me see if I can find it. So this is what I was looking at. The empty capture cube, but looks like we're going to need an eye vendor, which we do not have. Let's head back home and see. Actually, we do not have any because we can't make one because we have to kill all the bosses, which I still think is a little, a little OP because all the bosses are pretty hard to kill. It's like you can't even go to the end yet without without having to deal with the bosses and I I do think that that is a downfall of the mod that's my one dislike I love this entire mod I think it's one of my favorites I've ever played but it is just ridiculously hard to defeat the bosses for no reason so I'm trying to think of the best way I could do this without um, looking ridiculous and letting a whole bunch of zombies through. So I'm going to trade with them. Put that in here and then here. And you know what? Oh, I was going to let them free, but now I don't know. So I'm so mad because I literally just had the perfect clip of me getting a baby zombie down here. I had the perfect idea, okay? I let down one of these like little slabs and I built myself a tower. Let one of these slabs go. Baby zombie runs out, jumps out, follows me all the way up here. I then go ahead and make myself another tower. The z baby zombie gets in, kills the villagers. The villagers somehow get into the boat together. I kill the baby zombie that gets in this boat and then now they're in boats and they're healing right now. But you know what? That's okay. That's okay. I'm a little sad you guys didn't get to see it. But you know what? It happens. <sighs> Unfortunately, it does happen. I'm so sorry that I forgot to... Or actually, I lost... I lost the evidence. I lost the evidence of that clip. It makes me really sad. Yeah, I thought I hit record, but apparently I did not. It made me really sad. And of course, he's still staying at seven emeralds. What about this guy? This guy better give me a better price. I'll be so upset if he didn't. So upset. Alrighty, moment of truth. 26. You know what? I'll take 26. 
Let's go ahead and get them out of the boat. I'm so sorry. Please don't decrease your prices. I mean, increase your prices. Let's get you out of boats. And then we are just going to let you guys stay in here for a little bit. You know? We'll let you guys sleep. But in the meantime, let's go ahead and enchant this shovel. I went ahead and got our lapis from home. Got some lapis from home. Unbreaking silk touch efficiency four. That's better than the one that we've gotten here. Where did I put that one? Yeah, that's like way better than the one that we've got. Can we put these two together? By any chance? No, looks like it's still the same no matter what. But that's okay, because you know what? I'll just put mending on the shovel, and then it'll be okay. And we'll just use that one as our backup one. But let's go ahead and get to level 30 again, and then we'll enchant our bow again. Because let's just say this power 2 bow is not it. I'm not having it. So let's take care of these zombies, and we'll be right back.